Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in Hearts of Iron 4 using a mod called Hagakure, the East Asia Expansion, in which we're playing as the Empire of Japan. And see what this mod is like, and we're not led by uh, Hirohito here, but Okada Kaisuka. So, like I said, we're going to attempt to do a historical run with this mod on, but we'll see what happens with the rise of the Tose, Toseha faction, which I think is historical. And, but for those there's no description here, this, so this mod is still in a work of progress, but we'll see what we can do with it. Um, it says, we'll be able to play it, but not expect every focus working as intended, which kind of sucks. And we'll get the endless service rivalry here, get a little bit more stability, get more popularity of that F-word ideology, and then we'll have a little bit of a power struggle. Ni Ni Roku Jiken. We'll begin a new trial. The officers that are involved in the February 26th incident. In this trial, the political situation will change, and new factions will form, and more political power will lose a craft and stability of uh, uh, war support. The Navy Prime Minister. Oh, the Navy's won. The Imperial Rule Assistance Association. Honestly, if, we, if I uh, don't go really super, super historical, that's my bad. Because I know the unthinkable option didn't happen. This option is when you want to go to war with the. Uh, uh, so Union first, which actually is really kind of cool, and then you have the strength of the civilian government, which is a more democratic path. So it is what it is, but but we do want to go with our more historical path and go with the great, e Greater East Asia Co-Prosperity Sphere, which would be nice, and so just ascension, which I want to do. So the militarization of the Rhineland and Turkish Straits, whatnot. The Imperial Rule Assistance Association. I want to get this one. Uh, it's time to unite the various political parties, constituting the governments of national union, and make a nation of one party state dedicated to a great war for the liberation of Asia. Yeah. Uh, the February 26th incident is over and the coup has failed. We must now move to a secure position to establish a Toseha faction as the only dominant force in Japanese politics. The Emperor signed an ordinance on March 4th, 1936, establishing a special court marshal, Toketetsu Gumpo Kaiga, uh, and tried to those involved in the uprising. All 1,483 members of the Righteous Army were interrogated. The question of what to do with the Kodoha members is now discussed, which we do exile them. The uh, Japanese Imperial Navy will get more influence. Unlike the Mitsumasa Yonai to lead the Navy coup, dissolve the court and sentence the members to death. Army get more influence. Unlock the Army General Office, Prince Naruhiko, Prince Kotohito, Prince Fuminaro, and the Terauchi dictatorship. Well, I'm not sure which one it is, but we'll just give it to them. There you go. Give it to them. So we can't do that one. The Army's not won the power struggle, so. Um, but yeah. Hopefully we'll see what happens. We currently get po almost one political power a day. You know, I personally would prefer political power, but the political policies here is a little different than normal. Uh, do we get more weekly war support? Oh, that's kind of nice. Yeah, that's nice. Uh, quota immigration. We can go to closed borders. But I can get better consumer goods. Prime Minister? Oh. Oh, we get a president instead of a prime minister. That's interesting. A monarch, okay. Uh, we have a one-party state. We could have no elections, which actually be pretty nice, but that costs more political power, which kind of sucks. Well, uh, we have Shintoism. We can go to atheism, but eh. There's a lot of religions here. Chinese folk religions, huh? And state-controlled unions versus unions banned, so there's that stuff. Capital punishment, which I kind of don't mind. Um, penal labor, pretty good repairing. I might go incarceration. Uh, capital punishment, it's not bad. More construction speed, what I like, but I kind of want more political power, honestly. I might go with that one. Conservative general rules, uh, male-dominant society, absolute patriarchy, now that's my type of society. Bad public health care. Um, decent public health care. Oh, that's not bad. Private health care. Better for consumer goods overall. Uh, standard education. You propagand propagandize education. is not great because you lose 50% political power. But you get more weekly stability and weekly war support. You lose consumer goods but you get more recruitable population. Which we might need to do eventually. Knowing Japan. It's not bad. Militaristic education is not bad either. But you do lose a lot of political power. Uh, religious education actually is probably one of the best ones. Because you lose 5% research speed and stability. But you get better consumer goods and more political power. So overall, it's kind of quite interesting. We have population growth and stagnation. Encouraged. Enforced population growth. My type of Japan. But anyways, enforced plummeting. I mean, disencouraged? I mean, my god. Ooh. Anyways, even though I want more political power, there's not really many things here we can do except maybe get... Oh, one of these guys. Officials defiant. What is all in the court? Uh, and sentencing the officers to death immediately. We've not made any friends, or many friends. Especially when we off Navy officials are upset about our recent actions. Take care of them. Oh. With the rivalry right here. Ah, balance power nice. Do nothing. Take care of them. Take care of them. Trust of the Emperor. Oh. Trust of the Showa. Daily democracy support versus issue economic reforms. Um, 
Honestly, I don't remember. I'm pretty sure there's a Navy that won out. Democracy goes way down, which I prefer. Royals and politics. So we're going to try a circle, but we will see what happens. Oh, show statism. That's still not bad. Yeah, I'll probably go with this one, the army. This one. With gaining more influence in the government, we should seek to expand our support. Passing a law that allows members of the imperial family to actively take part in politics could be beneficial to our cause. Pro-Western course. Yeah, I don't want a pro-Western course. Yeah, no, we're going to go with the army. Pass a law. Allow royals to participate in politics. We don't need them. Um, pass a law. Well, royals. Yeah, we definitely want this one. Greater East Asian Prosperity Sphere. I don't remember. I don't know my Japanese history that well. We could cheat on the treaties too, which we might do. We probably want to do approved working conditions, but how many? Oh, 202. Wow. One party state and political instability doesn't help us out. State Shintoism, which is good. The communism ban, which is good. Zaibatsu, which is uh, not great. Duplicate air research efforts, which is very bad. Militarism, eh, good and bad. Rohito, of course, more stability, more balance. Political instability kind of sucks. Remove it. We need more political power. Electronic, mechanical, engineering. Actually, actually you know what? In the meantime, we're going to do this anyways. Get, get more stability. Faster stability. Ban the naval treaties. Um, we'll just ban it. Prince Naruhiko's plan. With the enacting of a plan that, or the law that allows members of the imperial family to take part in politics, Prince Naruhiko has offered a support in exchange for becoming prime minister. Decline. The Kotohito administration. I have no idea. Prince? Uh, sure. Sure, why not? <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, we would like some officers here too. Army offense? Oh, that's, that's pretty good. Prince Naruhiko becomes prime minister. I've su supported him to give the power. We secure the interests of the army. Good. Oh. Compl towards dictatorial rule. Okay. Interesting. Oh, I guess maybe we got the wrong guy. Oh, let's do this one. More political power, which is nice. Showa uh, statism. More political power to uh, influence. Um, more division attack, less division training time. I think it. General Tojo. More, a little more attack and political power. Interesting. If that establish a cabinet, that's probably a good thing to do. Um, when does this one expire? In a year? I'd rather just get whoever we can get now. Unaligned. Second London Navy Treaty signed. Consumer goods goes down by 5%, which is good. More political power here. Huh. That's interesting. More political power and stability versus political power and improve monthly and improve relations opinion. Righteous among the nations. War industrials. Technocrat, I like my use of technocrats too. Um, I do want more political power though, so. No more oh wow. We lost a lot of stability from that. Political instability. Capital punishment. It'll be a weird Japan that we have. But I want more political power. <clears throat> Alright, my territories. Metro governor, we're going to go civilian oversight and keep them on the horses. Which does have sport artillery, so we probably want to duplicate that. And I'll go G Boys. Yes, which makes four more marine divisions, whatnot. And. Uh, let's see. 18 count, which is pretty expensive. 12. That's very, very expensive. Holy crap. We'll go with this, probably this group here. That cabin is pretty good. Yeah, I'll probably do this completely asterisk, but whatever. Um, honestly, I only do it once ish. Hmm. That's seven. Yeah. That's probably as much as we want. Uh, weaken, weaken the civilian wing. Kind of trade laws. Uh, which one do we want? Because you need a guy that's at Batsis as well. The large corporations of our nation have long endured unprecedented political and economic power. With some finesse, we'll be able to guide their efforts in our favor. So what's over here? Black Dragon Society. Oh, that's cool. Challenge that Batsis. That'd be kind of nice. National Mobilization Law. Interesting. Alright, and dispersed. Uh, you know what? We're going to go with Constrate for this episode. Why not? No, policy doesn't really care too much about that one. Test the Soviets. Uh, what? Uh, whoa! Why is that in Italy? Whoa. We're gonna do that over there too. 
Um, Ethiopia's gone, and who do we have? Army drill, complete army expansion, plus 0.4, plus 0.3. I don't mind any more attack, honestly. Old guard, we're gonna go with you. Just go and grab him. We wanna start working on our army XP. We really need to do that. And you are gonna be a bunch of marines, who actually really, really suck. And you're gonna go with that guy, and these guys are literally only for combat with. Yeah, that's not very good. I don't go to war with anybody early. The Guangdong clique versus Guangdong clique. Can we go to war with them early? It'd be kind of nice, honestly. We could try it. I know it's not very historical, but you know, against them, sure, that's fine, whatever. And the Marine, which is not very good, but whatever. What if you were to go like from here? Because we're going to try to increase the size amount of these Marines. Be nice. And then you guys are also here. Um, I might just have you shipped off like there ish. Because we definitely need to make those Marines bigger, because right now they're just they're just not big enough. So we're gonna get the Zebatsis. Uh, national mobilization law. New legislation will make military service more ubiquitous, thereby instilling the people's sense of duty, as well as making the necessity of war clear to them. Um plain stuff would be nice, we'll get some gun stuff, because you can. And we're trying to build up a civilian factory, and then a military factory, synthetic factory, you know, a lot of factories. Basic medium airframes. It would be nice if we had planes. We don't really have planes. Oh, those are carrier stuff. Why are there, why are there carrier planes here? Hold on, what, what do you guys have on you? Not much. Carry naval bomber, naval bomber fighters. We can't produce crap, can we? Oh, here's some planes. Ah. Yeah. Well, that's not good. Um, definitely want get this guy over here. Oh, well, weather not bad. Air superiority is good. Plus point two, plus point two. We're gonna grab you. National Research Policy. Government support and control of our research institutions will allow greater flexibility and productivity in our R&D programs. I guess why not? The Marine, that's fine. Yeah, we can make them. Yeah, but we can. We're going to start making these guys actually like usable, maybe? Oh, god damn. You know what? We'll eliminate this one then. Maybe that. Let me add one more here. Make them as strong as you can for now. We're still lacking quite a few things here. All right. So after this one, nationalized war economy. That's good to do as well. Extensive conscription, war support, add total mobilization. Wow. Um, spiritual mobilization, warrior spirit, strengthen the divine wind. Interesting. But probably nationalized war industry because we get oh, more factories because we could use more factories. Period. Increasing state control of our war industry will go a long way to improving efficiency and therefore output. That's nice. Uh, what else do we have down here? Nanshin Ron. Oh, okay, got political instability. Men into China. Hoku Shin Ron. Hmm. So obviously can't do this because you want to go to the Soviet Union with this guy here. Or Eastern Republic. War on Bolshevism. But well, we're going to go historical ish. And hegemony over the Indies. Ooh. Fight over the Indies. Diplomatic effort. Fate of Korea. Fate of the Himalaya Kingdoms. Remove the Westerners. would be very nice. Fate of the Raj. Tora, Tora, Tora. Be a tough probably to beat them, but we'll see. Invasion of the West Coast. Demand to Mexico and reorganize America. Which we'll get there. Prince Noruhiko Higashikuni becomes leader of the fascist party. Oh, and the Manchuria Project. Expand the railways, which we actually probably want to do. Uh, Shuo Steelworks. The Mongol Project. Eh? Develop, 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 reinforce the border. Uh, develop heavy industry. Um. The Korean project, that's cool. And then we have other stuff over here, Army Expansion Law. Oh, the new Naval Estimates. Oh, that's pretty good to do as well. There's even more factories here too. We must issue new estimates for the size of the increase to our Navy, then thereby the dockyard facilities will be required to bring about this increase. But we'll do this one first, because we're going to go to war and need our army more than anything else more quickly. But we need some anti-air probably too. Mechanical computing is not bad. Some armor plates as well. Oh, uh, anti-confirm back. 
We are proposed that we sign a pact to address the common terms of the deal of spreading communism worldwide through the use of submergence and violence. Sign on this pact, we agree to share intelligence on the communist threat and act in close cooperation against its menace. Yeah, I will join you. Why not? Uh, what do we want here? Armored or just trains? Sure. Why not? We are at theorists, military theorists. This wouldn't be bad. We could do a military theorist just for funsies. Got a battle plan. Ah, let's get a naval guy here first. Plus point two. Ooh, naval attack from carriers. Capital ships point three. Oh, I'll go with you. So what do we have? We're gonna need a crap ton of guns, which we have okay amount of. Go go five here as well. And then at least we're making some planes hopefully slowly into war small airframe. Well we need more army air XP. Enter war small airframes. Are you bro kidding me? Are you like bro kidding me? Um, military police is going to be important as well. Get some radio. Having five research slots is so nice. It's not even funny. Go and repair all these ships too. We need to. And basic carrier naval airframe. Basic, basic carrier airframe. Enter war. Basic, basic, basic. And these are just okay. Uh, get some fighters. There we go. Electronics. Let that break. Nope. Good enough for me. Basic small airframe. There you go. Basic small airframe. We'll do one for Cass. Bomb locks. Mm. Yeah. That breaks. There you go. And then basic naval air carriers. One, two. We're done with this one. We're done with this one. Naval bombers would be nice too. Just to slowly start making them. Special module floats. Oh man, max speed goes way down. It's not great. Eh, well, it's too expensive though. There you go. There you go. Nice. Basic cast. I definitely love cast. Well, we can see you try to go to war with them. What do we have here? Another carrier, eh? It's fine. Oh, more. Oh. Well, okay. Um. I have like no fuel, but that's all right. Oh, we're all repairing. Look at all these guys. We got to repair. Shouldn't be too bad though. All right. Well, let's save and see what we can do well or not. I know it's not super historical, but we could try. That's the Soviets. I'll probably do some other stuff here too, but let's try command. 42 political power, that's really nice. Carriers, 15% more sword is not bad. Orders of a bigger navy. So they have government corruption, they have ineffective bureaucracy, and they have a generic focus tree. So we go to war with this part of China. Would anyone really complain? That's my question. So can the Marines go and do well? National the war industry, because we are already at war, aren't we? And we could do this. New naval estimates. Alright, why not? I've been convinced. And we're there. Nice. Got the airfield. That'd be nice. And there you go. So now I want to throw. Uh, oh, we guys are separate from stuff up here. Good throw these guys up here. But send these guys back home. Send them back home. Tokyo. You guys are up there ready to defend. You guys are doing all right. Um, I don't want to send too many guys here, but like, send like three guys right there or something. I really want to encourage them to attack us, so get you out. They'll start attacking us like crazy. We'll get infantry leader, commando, and maybe eventually. Ah, Spain's killing itself too. Nice. Ooh, if anything, we could have a little bit more fun here if we really wanted to. And build another naval port right here. So you know, we can say there and go there. Right. Let's 
survivability studies. Happy 1937, everybody. Some more output, please. Um, what else do we have around here that we really want? Infantry expert is definitely what I want as well, but what do we got building ourselves up? And refining. Fuel game for oil would be pretty decent. Okay, Nippon oil? Yeah, why not? Ah! Better. Ah, I'll have that done by May 15th. Can we use. You know, I don't want to have a too big of a border with these guys up here. Mm. They're not any part of any faction. Shang-Chi is here. The Hebe government. What if we did that too? Can we just, like, slowly just pick away China? We might be able to, maybe. You know, estimates? Could. Uh, let's see what else we got. National Defense State. Well, we could. Yeah, Colica Faction would be nice, but 70 days for that much, not very much. The Federal Rural Assistance Association. <coughs> it's time to unite the various political parties, constituting the governments of the National Union, and make a nation a one party state dedicated to the Great War, uh, Great War for the Liberation of Asia. It's for the liberation of Asia, that's right. Yeah, it's almost done. In war artillery, grab some anti air. Well, I'm just trying to beat the crap out of us, maybe. And yeah, get over there too. And for 37, construction speed. Be done in a few days, which is nice. And armor trains. Well, sneak up right behind him. Hamburg disaster, very good, very good. Can we take Beijing early? Probably not a good idea to, but. So much for being historical. Um, Ministry of the Ear, Greater East Asia. So I bought these investments, Pan Asian movement. Oh, wow. You got a lot more political power down there. National guidance. You need more political power, too. Wow. Mm, oh, Nanshin Ron. We could do that. Uh, national defense state. Every citizen must be made to see the urgency of the transforming your nation into a bastion capable of standing any assault. We might as well. What are we at? Two, two and a half? We lose a little bit of manpower right now? Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, whoops. Well, just for funsies, I guess we could. Get ready to go? Almost. Oh, just a few more days for that. That's fine. And here we go. Ah, you actually have people behind you, huh? Interesting. They're actually guarding the entire coastline. Interesting. Alright, so Grand Battle Plan, we could. Or we could get cheaper Grand Battle Plan, huh? Land doctor costs 10%, 15%. Honestly, so we're not going to really use very much. Just get a better bang for your buck if you do that, but. Oh, Gentojo. More attack. I like that one more. Great detection is nice. 37, yes. Hey, look at that. Nice. Good. Very good. I'll go that anyways. Whatever. How many planes can you send down here? 200. Fighters. Cass. Cass. Start lining them up. And there you go. Pretty good. Uh, military police is nice. 37. Grab more fuel for the love of all that is Jesus. And grab over there and grab that too. Amphibious. Sure, eh, that stuff's okay. I'm going to tell you guys to go home and come over here and just try to make one on zoo, maybe. To try it. Why not? You know. Need more steel, though. That's why I'm invading this area, too. Right? Yes. Steel. state. Spiritual mobilization, kamikaze stuff. Good development, sure, but I don't feel like it. Oh, let's do this one. Army expansion level. Our government must have one of its core tenets, the immediate and drastic increase of our military forces. Yeah. Is 
And let's go in. Let's see what we can do. Yes. We're giving our pilots a lot of workouts right now. Even though we have no fuel. Honestly, let's see. Ooh, you? Oh, my battle cruiser, nice. So he gets to go home. Ooh, uh, let's go with that one. I always like that one most. Good, they're expanding. And we're still trying to take that area too, which is not bad. Good. This bot's gonna really suck for a while. And you have taken the capital. Nice job, guys. Seven, some of that. Some more fuel for refining. And we're going to grab material designers or plain stuff fighters. Japan International Aviation Industry seems kind of cool. Naval bombers, Aichi, range, agility. Ooh. Or just. Oh, another minister. Naval stuff? Eh. Tank stuff? Mitsubishi? Eh, that stuff is okay. Let's grab you anyways. Good. Slowly but surely getting there. Nope. No fuel, that's okay. Oh wow, poor Spenta. Getting a little crazy, but that's okay. That's how we like him. Losses, a thousand versus seventy-one thousand. Very good, very good. Ah, we got him. Honestly, I think we probably just want to like create puppets eventually, but I guess we'll see. Small arms modernizations, army expansions. Oh. Well. Um, to achieve our aim of expanding the military, we must use the skills of those officers who have put in the ability to train men in the art of warfare. All right. Cool. Inner war armored cars, huh? G boys. They announced an alliance, that's fine. Replace that with military police. That'll be good. And extraction. <coughs> and extraction. Motorization, weapons and equipment. Eh, what do we want here? Maybe air support, capture ship attack, ground support plus fifteen percent. That's pretty nice. Marines, we're gonna send you. We're gonna get a navy invasion down here too. Eh, might as well. And then you guys are gonna do this instead. Pop, pop. Oh, we care, nice. Train, 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 train. Uh, get all that stuff done, which is good. Better light tanks, yeah, probably. I guess we could have helped out with the Spanish Civil War as well, but I think they're doing okay over there. Oppression. Korean Intelligence Agency. The Camp Bai Tai answers to the home ministry while at home, but they are under the army's orders while overseas. Such for the security of our imperial dominions. Cool. That's definitely not historical, but whatever. We also want the planes as well. Um, hold. Oh, let's see. You guys go up there. You do that. And where the tactical bombers go up there to there. There to there. You can barely reach them. Hmm. Not ideal. We have a lot of roads, but we need military factories. Boom. Oh. Oh, we could try it. We just manually have to take apart China one by one, maybe? Our guys are going for it. Alright then, they're gone. Bam. 
Thank you very much, I guess. Questions, a uh, sovereignty of them? Yeah, I, I guess. Let's go back, guys. Not bad. Um. Do all that stuff too, but uh, where's Cyan? Oh, Nanshin Ron. In order to secure a goal for our Asian supremacy and unity, we must first deal with Western colonialism. I guess we have to. Um, okay. Naval Theorist Grand Battle Plan. We could. Re rocketry. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's not bad. Carrier stuff would be nice, but we don't really need it now. I'm going to choose it anyways, though. Whatever. Radar? They have, they have really good infrastructure here. How do they have 80% infrastructure here in China? There goes those guys. Rubber processing, nice. Um, Sichiro Togo. You. Yeah. Planes would be good. More artillery, okay, yeah. Throw it anti air, yeah. Be pretty decent. More steel. Spanish Republicans defeated. Anschluss of Austria. Um, uh, Greater East Asia Co Prosperity Sphere. Yeah. Okay then. Greater propaganda. More war sport. Eh, we're good on war sport already. I'll go with that guy because we can. What else do we have? Ships? Cool. Very nice. Um, there we go. We don't have any carrier casts? Well, what, we have a lot of carrier casts. A few more trucks. Carrier naval bombers. Do we not have any carrier casts? Basic airframe. Huh. Well, I guess I'll have to research that next. It's weird. I would have it by now, but whatever. And I can't do this one. Oh! Oh, whoops. I guess we can't do Tojo's Ascension. Well, God dang it. Still, it's a government. Um. I didn't want this person to lead us. Pan Asian movement? Yen Block Empire Plan? Pan Asianism? Total War? It'd be kind of nice. Or new military schools. Well, I guess so much for being historical. Uh, show statism. I guess we'll do that one too. Um, oh, look at this. Expansion. How about up here? Flavor text. Prepare war plans for Manchuria. Spread pan Asian sediment in Manchuria. Asian collaboration, huh? Home Islands? Uh, they're not ready yet, no. No, no, they're not ready either. Outer Manchuria. China as a whole. Proof airplane catapults. Show sure. yeah. Um weaken the civilian wing? Sure, why not? We'll see what happens. Happy 1938, everybody. Pass Neutrality Act, alright, alright. Should be able to go to war with these guys pretty darn soon as well. Ooh, supply issues right there, that's not good. We have a radar though, that's pretty nice, it's pretty decent. Why don't we just beat up China like this? We might actually be able to take out this group and then just invade China. And then extra economic reforms, because we can. Proof light tanks, very cool. Uh, what do we want? Cast armor, sure. Why not? Proof small cannon. Doom enter. 
No more production costs, whatever. It's radio, anything else we really want here. Right ammo storage, don't really need that. Soft armor would be nice, but it costs even more. Honestly, I think that's pretty good overall still. Do you even have any tank? Yeah, we're not even making any tanks. Not yet. Do that. Oh, we got plenty of political power though. We got fields. Work conditions. We're kind of okay with that though. If you are fining, 38. Uh, I love that for support. Ah, there we go. Right, thank God. And after that, let's go to war first. Major foreign policy, liberty ethos. Oh, how big are these divisions? Oh my God. Literally just destroying them all. Oh, I forgot about this too. Um, should I have our pact? Sure. Why not? Well, we got some guns. Oh, I forgot. Uh, oh, just against China. Uh, so, China's going to the uh, Yunnan. They're going to do the UK. And the Qinghai meet clique. Shangxi next, maybe? Or I guess Guangxi clique, probably, actually. Cutting in 160 days, that's so long. Alright. Let's see where we need roads, really. suck. Whatever. Get that one done first. And a sign. German and Italian governments have agreed to sign the proposed tripartite pact, pledging to stand by a side in the event of a war. Excellent. We have a conference. With sending liaisons to all branches of the government and the military to a central conference, we can greatly increase our uh, decision-making speed. Good. Um, what is this? Any kind of sweep? Sure. Let's see if you detect any commies. Generators, no. Got a lot of things here, wow. There's cruisers, that was a lot of cruisers, huh? No radar yet, huh? No purpose secondaries, it's fine. Level three is probably better. Level twos, level twos. We have everything better, right? No, we don't. Um, do that one instead here, and then this one you do go there. Thank you. And nope. Uh, we have secondary cruiser holes. Yeah, whatever. Combos would be good too. Because we'll definitely need some. Zubio class? Ah. Converted cruiser. Not fantastic, but whatever. And how do we do this? Uh, seems a bit bugged, because I'm pretty sure we have Prince Negashune Naru Naruhiko. First military rule. I can't do this one though. So if we can't do it anyways, we might just use Khan's commands to get this anyways. Empire plan, you know, Tojo's ascension. That seems a bit bugged. Because we have this guy ruling, yeah. Prince. Military dictatorship, oh. Direct rule from Tokyo. So I guess we'll see in just a little bit. Um, oh, Black Dragon Society. Black Dragon Society is a secret society embedded in our secret services. Some of the contacts could serve us well. Serve us very well. Yeah, why not? How's it coming along? We're building it fast at all? Oh, Village Brone. Oh. Oh, okay, well. <clears throat> Sometime during last night, 
A century away, or away in Manchuria collapsed under the weight of a passing munition train. Rescue and recovery efforts have been made difficult by the secondary explosions from the ammo. The crew of the train is still missing and presumed dead. Military intelligence has dispatched a team to investigate the site as soon as it is safe to do so. To find out how long uh, how sturdy a bridge could collapse with no warning signs. Local witnesses report seeing a small group in the valley below the bridge on the day before the collapse, so we're about to circle unknown. Who did such a thing? Strange provocation. Oh boy. Well, we might want to get ready then. Okay. New details have emerged from the lightest stack under soil. While none of the perpetrators have been cut so far, evidence clearly suggests that it was a deliberate provocation by the Chinese. The Chinese government has uh, been suspicious, slow, suspiciously slow in condemning the attack, and the Chinese newspapers have hailed it as a heroic act of defiance against Japanese imperialism. The cabinet's assembled to discuss matters and proposed measures to deal with the blank, blatant assault. Demand an apology? Most people have prepared to go to war? We should withdraw completely. Um, okay, yeah. But if we go to war with them, they're going to take by them. Uh, well, I guess we should probably still go to war with Shang-Chi then. I'm going to war with the Chinese Soviet government. Uh, are we going to war with these guys too? Oh. Oh, whoops. Well, hold on. Now go back. See what you can do. Competition, of course. Might kind of sweet. Doesn't seem like it does very much for us, does it? No, it does not. Um, I like mobility focus quite a bit. Dex size plus dex size plus one. Doesn't seem like very much to me. A little bit less armor, more max range. Uh, doesn't seem really great either. I'll get Kempai Tai. That seems like a right thing to do. Ambassador to Germany, huh? I'll do that one. Why not? Thirty-eight. Better radar. Why not? Uh, equipment conversion. Oh, sure, too. How are we doing with supply stuff? Well, we're getting there. Definitely one fortress work in progress, though. Fighter's good. Nice. And what else can we choose from here? Yeah, I'll do, I'll do that in a little bit as well. Um, supremacy of will. Supremacy of technology. Probably will is what we want. Death and defense. Ooh. Lunge mines. Ooh. Raise a boy tie. Volunteer Corps. Prepare an invasion. Fighter modernization. We must maintain air superiority of our enemies in all areas, including air warfare. Modernized fighter planes are essential to achieve this. Good. Come on, let's get build, build, build. Just slowly getting there too, but it takes them so freaking long. Train. Alright. Stagnation. Discouraged. Encouraged. Nice. Well, let's do this now. Well, can we go to war with them and do okay, maybe? They may start taking us there. And do that. Get good word normal China, but they're still guaranteed. Which sucks. Chongxi is next on the list. 200 days, my god. Land reform, public works. They just have a lot of stuff here that they really need. So, Well, let's grab some planes. Fighters, attack bombers. Uh, is that all the castle we have? No? Yeah, we have more here. There you go. That should help us out. Oh, they're doing force attack, huh? Nice. Um, these guys want to help out? No, we're good. We're going to struggle here, but that's okay. Uh, sure. Why not? 
What else are we missing? Artillery? We got plenty of guns now. A little more art would be nice. Also, how many thousand? Four thousand versus fifty thousand? My god. Depth chart throwers? Cool. Um, get playing stats a lot of time. I don't care. It's only a year ahead of time. Whatever. Struggling. Shizuo Yokohama? Yes. Good being an organizer. Good. And a mountaineer and a skilled staffer. Awesome. Awesome. Very bloody, but that's okay. For now. You guys are... This one, which is 18, which is not bad, but you want more artillery on them anyways. You... Um, Spider modernization is very nice too. Very good, very good, very good. Oh, range focus. Agility focus, yeah. Range alone will do us no good. Our models cannot compete with the enemy when they arrive. We must produce crap with superior agility. So they might be never out uh, maneuvered. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, war bonds. Okay, yeah. Where I claims my mill. So be it. Ah, good. That's fine. Or, you know, supply base. Additionally, keep making more factories, maybe? Out of my industry. Nope. An independent career. Nonsense. We're becoming a trickster, becoming a skill staffer, a mountaineer, like I said. Um, anything else really changing? Not too much. Federator is very good, though. Ooh, are we out of artillery? Ooh, that sucks. That's right. We'll make up for it in just a little bit, too. <coughs> Might make our war with China a little bit more difficult, but that's okay. They have a lot of divisions here still. Up to 33. Wow. That's good for them. Oh, well. Oh, so these guys are actually 12 combo. That sucks. Oh, we're definitely out of artillery now. Holy crap. Oh, my God. You know, just do that anyways. And shove them right here. Uh, bomb modernization. Carrier warfare experiments. From sea fleet. I like that one a lot, though. Sub modernization. Railway guns, huh? Cruiser modernization. Oh, I like that one. Cruisers will be the main server of task forces throughout the Pacific, so we need the best that we can build. That took a while to do, actually. But that's okay. Some things take time. Good things take time. So now, that mind, you have like no supplies here, so now we get to add another base, like from here to there, from there to there. And so, Len leads. Do we have any artillery left? No, we don't. Or trucks. God dang it. Uh, in the meantime, you boys, add on a armored car. And we'll do this too. We're not going to have enough. But that's okay. Not really, but whatever. Better guns. Are we out of armored cars? Yes, we are. So we need more armored cars then. Go to three. And reduce it by three for now. Good. And more fuel, rubber, all the good stuff. Hey, got enough stuff though now for now. Yeah, it's good. Very good. Ship wise, how many more ships do we have? We have six god awful subs that are just going to be destroyed pretty much instantly since they go to war with somebody. Um, and the Fitch Slovakia is good. Our war machine is going to be running very nicely, actually. Zubishi. And then I want to divert naval guns to the army. Redesign naval guns. There's nothing bonus there, so I like this. Let's do this one instead. Maybe a little bit more docket output, whatever. Instead of a battleship turret, we could have a railway artillery. Yeah. Hey, uh, we've left. Not bad. Oh. I could just go to war with them, but I don't want to go to war with the British yet. I mean, give us like another 60 days and we'll be fine. Cool. Might as well. I'm going to do more naval stuff then, too. Little last torpedoes. Chance to see critical hits. Torpedo screen penetration. Nice. Um, it's modern, it's modernization. Our military force require a mod modernized weaponry to be able to compete with those of our potential enemies. Gold look of faction. Or a small arms modernization. Yeah, gold look of faction. Japan is lacking in oil. We must redouble our efforts in the field of synthetic oil. Yeah. Well, let's just do one more war before we go on. Oh, we definitely need that. And more max weapon. Yeah, that's good. Very good. And that, if you heard that, was my uh, laundry being done. Cool. How much better power do we get now? 1.67. That's pretty, that's pretty good. Nice. Very nice. Um, anything else? No? Okay. Uh, let's see. Political advisor. Righteous. Yeah, we have a righteous cause. 
You might not realize that we do have righteous cause, but we do have righteous cause. Malt of Ribbentrop Pact. Consumer Goods goes down. That's not bad. Yeah, let's go that one now. Bad Consumer Goods. Yay! Thanks and whatnot. After that, we'll go to war with China to Northwest Army, huh? Struggle here. Uh, gonna call on our allies too, maybe? Did you guys do that, maybe? Maybe not, yes, no, maybe so. Artillery is. We're, doing, we're positive on artillery, okay. Good to see. Yeah. I'll pick up the divisions. Two divisions will up to 28 battalions, huh? Alright. Alright, not bad. I'm gonna go to war those guys. Northwest Army's next. Oh, they're a puppet. But they're oh, so what happens if you just find a puppet then? Northwest Army, huh? Well we're taking China piece by piece, which is not how we're supposed to do it, but whatever. Um Spiritual mobilization? By cultivating these tenants of Shinto that play on the people's sense of military duty, we can increase the amount of new recruits. You guys are 33 combat with. Oh my god. That's freaking huge. Massive. Absolutely massive. Uh, medium tanks, but maybe we'll get there. Crew like tank chassis. Nice. Oh, wait. basic light tank. Proof light tank. That's better. Um, you know what? Go with that one. Two more. And we got Shang-Chi. No, it's ours. It's our bro. Oh wait, they took this too. Oh, you son of a You gonna die, son, you gonna die. Let's see. What is it? 13? Uh, uh, uh. That's good. You guys are fine. Actually, I'm out with the Marines up here, too, then. Gonna be fighting over river, anyways. There you go. Type 100s. Cool. Poland is like, nah, not today, brah. And World War Uno started. Infantry equipment, nice. Oh, this thing. There you go. And railway guns. Nope. Guns. There you go, nice. Well, let's see what we can do. Five suck. Oh, there you go. Grabbing everybody's there. Needs one and one. Won't take too long. Oh my god. You know what? You're almost done with that one. Ah, uh, see, there you go. There you go. See, not bad. Uh, well, maybe not you right there. Right there. there you go. Throw the faction. Modern's modernization. And then pack guns. Mm, sure. Work in progress. Modern artillery. The wall surges are brave and fierce require superior artillery to evade their advance. Bicycle battalions. Mobility is key. Our force will be equipped with bicycles. Drastic improving ability to maneuver divisions around. Cool. Oh. Oh, they actually need guaranteed by them. Like, bruh, why would you do that to us? Like, bruh, arenos. Well, I guess we're gonna war these guys next. But that sucks. That really sucks. Well of Warsaw. Hey, but it feels always good though. There you go. And expert again. Next up, Poland is gone. Bye Poland. Oh, Commerce Cell discovered in Johol. 
Hunting on the information gathered by the intelligence service are patrols. I've uncovered a major communist base area. We strike it once before they can get more organized as the rest resist or attempts to remove them. Speed is of the essence. Mm. Trying to set threat receding? Cool. There you go, too. Mm. Now I got the Dutch. Well, I'll give you one more one out. Racist laws. Oh, those are my types of laws. Oh, bad public health care. There's some consumer goods, though. Uh. Relation growth, capital punishment, penal slavery, rehabilitation, huh? Well, we'll see what we want next, too. Oh, we just don't have enough. Carry, carry, fighter, fighter, naval arms. Yeah, that's fine. All right, nice, nice, nice. God dang, it's going to Shahar, huh? Glad Rudolph has. Cool. Good. Uh, pack guns. Germany is on the roll. Of course, we're on, kind of on a roll too, but not that much of a roll. We're rolling enough. As is. Three days left, that's good. Can you go in? Um, weird, but okay. Better be receding. Um, Vichy France. Can we demand into China yet? No? Okay. Well, after them, Gansu Click, I guess, is next. 100 days, that's much better. Now we've got to start taking out some colonies of uh, those guys. So. Mm, you guys are still going to be by China, huh? Excavation. Well, we'll see if we can go to the puppet next time, too. There's some, just something I don't know yet. Good. Pack guns. Bicycle boys. Those boys in a bicycle, and we don't want them. Oh, God. Film industry, war sport, women in the workplace. Uh, Alright, we got them, so. I guess we'll probably end the episode here. If you enjoyed the video, though, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I guess I'll see you tomorrow. What else we can see? What else we can do in this mob? Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.